And welcome back to the Triple Threat Show on ChicagolandSportsRadio.com as we get it in and the people that follow put some hip hop. Like the hip hop and rock at the same time. I like that, yeah. We are going ham on the Triple Threat Show. Number 312-884-8205. Again, 312-884-8205 in our email. Triple Threat Show 3 at Yahoo.com. Once again, Triple Threat Show 3 at Yahoo.com. All right, guys, we're back on the show, and it is a people's half hour when we get to do deals with you, the listener. You get to talk about whatever you want to talk about. As a matter of fact, I don't even know why I even say what happens, because Ernie says it all as a sweeper. So I should just stop talking and get down to this. Number 312-884-8205. Again, Once again, 312-884-8205. All right, to start the people's app hour off, don't forget we got birthday shout out, so don't go anywhere. But we do have to send you. Just send you out for the one that brings the top to not just the top to And uh, good looking, son. I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Okay. I'm not ready. <laughs> Tell me, second away, what is your not top 10 this weekend, please? Make us laugh. Okay, laugh. well, the last time I was here, it was like the dumbest, um, dumbest, like, athletes turned criminals. So this time I got something similar to that. It's just like dumb crimes, dumb things people do. Number 10, I got Maddie Patterson. He was caught red handed with his trousers down. Yes. Yes, with his trousers down. He thought he was going to go swimming that day, and apparently it was his day off, and he, he didn't realize until he was already in his car with his trousers down, literally. Number nine, Roman Bednar. He was caught red handed buying drugs outside his home. He was actually caught on video doing this. And number eight, Glenn Johnson, he was caught red-handed stealing bathroom fittings. Basically, like a 74-year-old security guard at the mall was like, hey, switch the tags, and then, you know, we'll get this going. And then that's exactly what happened. And then after that, I mean, he just pretty much got busted, and he got, like, 80 euro fines right on the spot. Number seven, Diego Maradona. He got oh, red- Diego. Yeah, he, oh. caught, uh, he got caught red-handed peppering journalists with an air... Uh, with an air rifle. I guess they were outside, they were trying to take pictures, and he didn't think that the steel gates were enough, so basically he just started shooting from, like, his house, and then he still has yet to uh, Jesse, serve no, a two-year sentence. That's no surprise, Jesse. Yeah. No surprise. Number three. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. Number six, died, uh Thomas. Car red-handed running with a hooligan gang at Euro 2000. He spent a summer in Belgium at Euro 2000, and basically he was arrested and deported. He was later jailed, banned from football grounds for food further hooligan offenses. Wow. Numero cinco, Peter Story for importing porn. <laughs> he was sentenced for importing porn in 1990s, suspended sentence for running a brothel in the mid to the uh, end of the 70s. And you just dropped my I'm sorry, Can you just... fix this? Thank you. Numero cuatro, Tony Adams for drunk driving. That was just plain stupid. Wow. Numero tres, Peter Swan, caught red hand in match fixing. Peter Swan, along with some other people that were called uh, British football's most infamous match fixing scandal back in the 1960s. The scam was exposed, and the uh, three players bet against their own team, and the bet was only for like 50 euros, which I googled it. It's like 66 dollars and 20 cents. So that was stupid. I need some of that. <laughs> Number two, Mickey Thomas, caught red-handed passing forged bank notes. Who does that? And it was for like 10 euros, 20 euros. So, I mean, you could already pretty much do the math in your head. That was pretty stupid. Number one, Caesar, I don't know how you would pronounce it, caught red-handed involved in a heist of club bonuses. He was using insider knowledge, so basically he was pulling like a Martha Stewart. Uh, the club bonus structures to inform two friends that there was 100000 lying around waiting to be split amongst the squad. Him and his friends uh, split up the money, but what they did was right away they went and bought cars, and, I mean, they just made themselves look so suspicious, and then they just got caught, and they just went down the drain. They pulled up Melinda's brothers. Well, that's why they're on your list, right? Yes, that's why they were number uno. Jesse always doing videos on the not top ten 